Ben, uh, anything uh, to add to the report that there was a problem with your rotator cuff? No, I mean, it happened early last year, um, and we worked uh, really hard. I mean, I think some of, some of the people in the media knew about it, so they did a good job keeping it quiet. I thought, thank you for that. Mm -hmm. um, but you know what, we, uh, no, we worked really hard at getting it right to play, never missed uh, any time. Doc Bradley, the trainers, John Norwig, everybody, um, just spent so much time um, rehabbing, getting it right, and um, you know, it feels great right now. And that's, that's kind of what surprises kind of happen because it, it isn't a new injury, it's nothing new. I wasn't, uh, never complained about anything, just was uh, simply making a, a statement about something. And, and you got no they, surgery, right? There's no surgery? No, 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 absolutely not. No, I haven't, there was no injection, there was no, nothing other than just simple, um, Rehab. And typically, rotator cuff, you lose a lot of strength. Have you experienced any of that in the arm at all? No, I haven't. You know, the, the, the person I could probably answer these questions better are, are the doctors. Um, the, the way I was explained is that it's torn like string cheese long ways instead of sideways, which is, quote, unquote, uh, the better way to tear it. Mm -hmm. So, and it's, it's only a, it's a partial tear. So, um, that's why I haven't had any, um, uh, haven't seen any side effects of uh, loss of strength or anything. We just, um, you know, I, in telling it, I just, you know, I take less throws because, one, because of that, but two, because I am getting a little bit older and it's uh, might as well just save the arm a little bit. Mm -hmm. Were you uh, ever close, Ben, to not playing last year? Was it ever no, 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 never. I mean, it, it's one of those ones that um, the doctor says, listen, let's just avoid throwing too much um, and walk through stuff when it's when you don't have to throw and, um, and try not to land on it. I mean, it happened in the Baltimore game and uh, it just got extended the wrong way. Um, and it, it, it was never an issue. Of, you know, I've dealt with a lot of pain and uh, it wasn't going to take me out. And other than getting a few less throws, though, but you won't be limited to camp and all in any way. Oh, no. Listen, guys, this happened, the, the Baltimore game at home. So, it, you know, you didn't see any drop off in my play last year right. of throwing the ball, and you haven't seen it yet. And I know you guys would have known it if, it, if we wouldn't hadn't talked about it today, which I, I kind of thought it was a non-issue since it happened so long ago. And, and it really is. It's, I'm letting you know now it's, 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 a, it's a serious non-issue because okay. I'm just fine. How's and dinner? So Great. <laughs> 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 it's a lot made of you, Haley, not talking right away when you get hired. How are you guys? Great. No, oh, yeah, you know what, there, there's a lot of rules um, that the league makes about being able to talk to someone when they first come in and, and during off season. So we, we technically couldn't talk anyway, so we didn't want to break any rules because uh, we know how the league cracks down on, on things like that, so we didn't want to break any rules. Hey, how did everything, everything go off the no huddle yesterday? It went, it went well. You know, it's like it was a good start. We did a little bit today as well. I thought it went a little bit better today, and um, you know, we're going to keep making progress and strides to keep getting better. Ben, it sounded like even even not in the no huddle that Todd Haley is okay and likes it when a quarterback calls his own plays. You were saying that yesterday. Is that something that he's indicated to you, and would you look forward to that? Yeah, I think he's he's kind of uh, mentioned to me about kind of making it, uh, I don't want to say my, our offense, you know, letting us do it. And I, you know, we've heard uh, Bruce say that in the past, and I think a good coordinator that, that trusts his players, um, that's a good way to go. You know, we're going to work together, and that's what uh, doing this no huddle. It's I don't feel comfortable enough just saying let me let me take it over. I'd rather work with him right now until I get comfortable uh, calling myself. Ben, any idea of uh, when Mike Wallace might show up? Any, any thoughts at all about him not being here and when he might get here? Well, it's it's tough because Mike's a good friend and a teammate, and he's a great teammate, and um, we're excited. I've been talking to him a little bit, and we'll be excited for him uh, when he does get here. I'm sure he'll. Uh, He'll be here and he'll be with us before the first game. I'm, I'm, I'm sure of it. I don't think he'll wait very long.